Okay, so the first thing that you need to do is head over to Google and type in Shotkit free Instagram story templates. Then hit enter and look for the result that includes the word Shotkit in it. And this will take you to the page that I've created, which just gives you a bit of background about why I created these templates. Um, if you don't want to read that, just scroll all the way down till you see this share box. And all I want you to do is click one of the buttons and that will share the post. And then you can enter in your email address after that and I will send you some templates for your Instagram stories. So the first thing you'll see when you open the templates file is this index image, which shows all of the Instagram story templates. I like the look of number 25, so I'm just clicking on the eye icon there just to bring it into view. Then I'll expand the layer using the little arrow by the side of it. Double click on the layer marked photo one. Then I'll grab my photo and drag it into there. As you'll see, I'm using a landscape orientation photo on top of this portrait orientation image but it won't matter, just hit Control or Command S to save it. And then when you return to the original template, you can see that my landscape orientation photo isn't quite placed in the right position. All you need to do is make sure that you're using the Move tool, so shortcut is V, and then hold down the Shift key while dragging and you can just place that image in the right position. Next thing, double click on the next photo layer and same thing, drag and drop your image in. Obviously, if it's a portrait orientation photo, it will be perfectly aligned. Hit Control or Command S, return to the original template, and as you can see in this case, it looks fine, so I don't really need to do anything, but I can if I want to by clicking and dragging, holding the Shift key. And the final layer, double click on that photo layer, grab my final image, and just to show you what we can do here, if I grab one of the resize handles holding down the Alt key, then I can resize in this way just to fill up that portrait orientation. Hit Command or Control S. Then as you can see, it's actually perfectly aligned there. If you want to resize any of the images, all you need to do is select one of those layers and hold Control or Command T and then just drag using one of the handles and you can actually resize the image itself. Obviously, you'll need to change the text layer as well by clicking on that and making your edits. You can also add to this template. You can put your logo on it or just change the design however you want to. And when you're happy with it, hold down Shift and press Control or Command S, which is the shortcut to save as, and then just choose JPEG as your output format and upload into Instagram to use as your next story template.